Now from the land of 10,000 lakes, we've got afternoon baseball from Target Field in Minneapolis. Minnesota it should be a good Twins. conquest matchup tonight between the Knights and the Twins. It's baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Into the box now, number 86. And we are ready for some Leading daytime baseball. For the, night, the left fielder, number 86. Here's the first pitch to him. 0 oh, 1 the count. First pitch, 1 o'clock. The wind up and the 0 oh, 1. Strike two swinging just out in front of the slider. Hey guys, that's just a nasty pitch right there. I can't tell you how many nightmares I've had about nasty sliders, and that's exactly what that was right there. The 0 2 once more. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. And a great day for baseball here 81 degrees at first pitch. Hit the other way out toward right field. Cruz sprinting after it, but he won't get to it. And this should put a man in scoring position to start the inning. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. The speedy Trey expect. Turner digs in now. Down. Trey Turner. He's set. Here it comes. Just able to get a piece of that for strike one. Turner takes his swings from the right-handed batter's box, but he's one of those rare hitters that actually thrives facing same-handed pitching. One of the very best in the game, as a matter of fact, in that type of matchup. Yeah, Matty, he does not leak with that front side. He keeps that shoulder tucked, stays inside the baseball, and it gives him every opportunity to hammer the fastball and stay on that breaking stuff. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Not a bad pitch there with two strikes, but it misses one and two. Not a bad pitch right there on 0 and 2, a fastball. And I think as a hitter right now, you have to continue to go up there. Look. Oh, and he can't come up with it. And a good effort as he's able to gather it in and make a play for the first out. So a definite RBI third. spot here. Runner at third, Gary one away. Sanchez. And the next to bat, the Dominican born catcher, Gary Sanchez. Hit. The run comes across to score, and they jump ahead 1-0. Stepping in, Freddie Freeman. First that shot for cool. him here with a runner first at first now and five. one away. Freddie Freeman. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Breaking ball that's cut on and missed for the first strike. Now a splitter, and he lays off a ball and a strike. And the reason he's working away so much here is because he's got that big hole on the right side of the infield to worry about with the first baseman holding the runner on. It's always smart to pitch into the defense you have behind you. Fastball, strike three called as he couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. That is big. Now in the, the box, center field, Ronald Acuna. He takes his first Ronald cuts in Acuna. this one with a man at first and two away. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. And that's in there. Base hit. Now a long throw to third. And he is in there. So two that on with hit. two away. The and right into bat next, the big time RBI Charlie man, Charlie Blackman. Blackman. Hoping to limit the damage, here's the pitch. Liner into right center. That's a base hit. And not in time as the run scores. Now a good throw in will hold that second runner at third base. So they're that at the seven. corners now with the two away. Jose Altuve. From the belt. Kicks and deals. And he drops it. And a great job to stick with it as he's able to make the play for the third out. Into the box, Jorge Polanco. He'll lead things off here in the bottom Leading half of the first. For the twin, the shortstop, Jorge. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. Oh, 
A ball and two strikes to the twin shortstop. You know, from an offensive standpoint, they already knew they had their work cut out for him against a great pitcher. But if he's going to locate like that, this is going to be a tough day. Batting second. So he notched the no back field K on that one. Eddie. Jorge Polanco is retired Ray for the first Sario. down here in the bottom half of the first. Now here's the pitch. Lifted in the air toward the line and right. But this is going to wind up a foul ball. Not close with the off-speed pitch taken for a ball. I love a well-executed changeup, especially one down in the zone. The only problem throwing it in that situation, you leave that belt high or miss your spot just a hair, and you could have some problems. And it's fouled away. And he takes strike three called. Back-to-back -back strikeouts here to open the hole first. Two away. The right fielder, Nelson. Through. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Back-to-back -back punch outs in the bottom of the first. This guy has got his stuff working today. This offense better wake up. Two balls and a strike. He's going to have to make adjustment on that slider away. He can't just make it a non-competitive pitch and allow these guys to take. He's got to start that a little bit more over the middle of the plate to get that swing and miss on the outer half. And a good job there to lay off. It's ball four as he becomes their first base runner of the ball game now. That two four. away. The first base and a strike to start the at bat. Nothing in one. Bro. Not too often do you see a changeup come across at 88 miles an hour on the gun. Still effective when you're throwing a fastball in the high 90s, though. The next twin up, Marwin Gonzalez. He'll swing it the from second the left baseman. side right here. Marwin lays off one Good dollar. Lifted down the line in left. And that will end up a foul ball. Uh, changed things up on him, and he got him to swing through it. One and two now. Just a bit high with the fastball, but didn't get the call. Oh, now here's a drive out to the alley. Rounds the corner and is headed home. run comes around all the way from first to score. It's now a 2-2 ball game. Batting fifth. There's third a baseman. Right down Broadway Got taken there. for a strike. Go. I think this inning could have far-reaching effects in this game. They're really making him work, and unless he dials it in, it's probably going to limit how deep he goes into this game. Freeman is there to make the catch, and the side is retired. And that'll bring up the former first runner, Alex Ford Bregman. Ford. He'll get us started base. in the top of the second. Bregman. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Here, Swung on and missed for the first strike. You know, that can really be an effective pitch for a guy that has a lot of pop. They're up there looking for a fastball up in the zone, so if you can place it a little above it, they have a hard time getting the barrel up there. Behind 0-2 now. The windup and the 0-2 pitch. Hit sharply on the ground. Gonzalez is there. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. Ladies Chris and Davis gentlemen, will get the call here please. as he'll hit for the pitcher. Pinch hitting. Chris Davis. Gonzalez is up with it. Pro gets him. Two down. Striding into the box. Number, number 86. 86. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Hit hard towards center. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. So the speedy Trey Turner gets a chance following the base hit. So it's a runner at first now with two gone. And that'll bring up one of Trey. the fastest players Turner. in all the land, Trey Turner. First pitch on its way. Strike one to start the at-bat. Now a swing and a miss at a slider for a strike. 
over to the bag. A dive, but he's back. Here's the 0-2. Pulled the fastball down a little too much there. That's ball one. And a curveball swung on and missed. And a great call there as the inning is over. Your attention, please. Now so a new pitcher is sent to enter the Ken ball game right now, and it's Jansen. the converted catcher, the hard-throwing right-hander, Ken Lee Jansen. Lee and a cut fastball twist. in there for a strike. The it's 0-1. Jason Castro. Now Tuve at second, played on the backhand, and that's the first out. So striding in, Batting Cameron it. Buxton. The center fielder. First delivery to him on the way. Hit hard to third. Buxton. Diving try, but it's through into the outfield. Your attention, please. Will be summoned up to the bench here. It's a pinch hit with Number a runner 64. first and one gone in the inning. Cut fastball in there for a called strike. Oh. And a fastball yeah, mm, just misses. Strike. It's one and one. Down the left field line and deep. And this will wind up a foul ball. And he fouls this one off. Buxton, the runner at first with one gun Three. in the inning. And now a slider in there for a called third strike. The batter number two 11. Gone now. Shortstop. Jorge. And that misses inside one and all. Oh, go. There goes Buxton. That's Three. a strike to throw down. And no throw in fact as he'll just hang on to it. Two and one now to the Twins leadoff man. Counts even two and two for Polanco. I got to count two and two. Look out as this bat shatters on impact. He had a close play at first, but he's called out and the side is retired. Ladies Tyler and Duffy, a right-handed reliever, please. standing six now three, gets the, the ball win. now out of the bullpen. Number twenty-one. Digging Tyler. in, Gary Sanchez. Duffy. He'll step in to lead it off in the top of the third. Line toward the alley in left center. Buxton is in retreat as he pulls it in for the first down. Ready now, Freddie Freeman. Freeman. First time up, he went down looking. Yeah, Maddie, and he was locked up by a good fastball for strike three last time. I'm interested to see if they attack him the same way. Come at him with hard velo late or snap something off in the dirt to see if they'll fish. The Standing in, Ronald Acuna. It's one away. The runner at first represents the potential go-ahead score. Double play is in order, however. Runner at first here with one away in a 2-2 ball game. I always say hitting's a process of elimination at the plate. I think he could go ahead and eliminate changeup. Two in a row back to back. I don't think there'll be a third. Swing and a miss. Looked like the knuckle curve there, and that's out number two. The right fielder, number nine. Here's Charlie Blackman now. Charlie. There are two what? gone and the possible go-ahead run at first. And that'll get down for a base hit. So it's first and second with two men now gone. Bad. And second striding piece. in the speedy second Jose. baseman, Jose oh, Altuve. And this is off the corner and low, ball one. Zero. Looked like he wanted to clobber that one, but it's one and one. Ready with the one one. Line toward the gap in left center. And that finds the outfield grass for a base hit. And the run is in to score from second. Two men on, two out, and the that'll bring up the LSU product, Alex Bregman. Bregman. First delivery to him on the way. Lifted into the air out towards center field. Buxton is under it, and that retires the side. Now to the plate, Eddie Rosario. He'll lead it off against Jansen, who tries to close the no door in this one. Eddie. Fastball catches the block Rosario. there for a cold strike. Rosario behind with an 0-2 count. 
hey, this is the game within the game right here. The hitter has to decide if he's going to change his game plan. Is he going to stay staunch and wait for him to miss now over the heart of the right plate or inside? Or is he going to adjust his sights and try and drive Rude. the ball the other way? Ready with the nothing in one pitch. And that is swung on and missed, and things are starting to look bleak here for the home nine. They're the on batter. two away now. The first baseman. A swing and a shot hit Throw. down the corner. And foul, though it had the home run distance. Here's swing up. and a miss, and he's in trouble now. 0-2. Oh, Final strike for the Twins. And this ball swung on and hit to center field, and this should do it. Acuna is there to make the catch, and with that, the ball game is over.